good? It's your girl B here and I'm back with yet another video. If you are new to my channel, hey boo, hey, hey girl, hey, what is up? What is good? What's litty? Thank y'all so much for choosing to kick it with me. And for my old subscribers, what's lit? Like, what's good? Y'all ain't know what's going on. I was scrolling through a lot of my comments in some of my previous videos and I saw like the same, pretty much the same type of comment posted over and over and over again. Sis, can you do a what's in my bag video? Boo, can we see what's in your bag? Girl, I got you. I just got back from a little event with my family, with my mom and my dad. These eyelashes may come off somewhere in the point of this video because this left one is really trying me like I'm not a child of God. I'm gonna be doing a what's in my bag tag, what's in my bag challenge, what's in my bag video. I'm gonna show y'all what I got in my bag. But before I do that, y'all already know what to do. Hit that subscribe button down below. If you guys have not already, join the Beehive Gang, the Beehive Fan, because we are lit and we are never bougie over here. Do you understand me? And also while you're doing that, go ahead and hit that little bell button down there as well. So that way you will never miss any uploads from your girl and you'll be what was this? <laughs> You'll be notified whenever I upload any video and you won't miss out on anything. And yeah, let me just show y'all what's in this bag. First and foremost, I wanna give a big, big thank you to Teddy Blake for sending me this bag. This bag was sent to me by Teddy Blake. So when they first contacted me, I was kind of skeptical about trying them because in my mind, I automatically had prejudged the whole company, their whole style, just assumed that everything they was gonna have on display was gonna be completely before my time, too old for me, too grown for me. I wasn't really feeling it. But after I scrolled through the actual website and looking at what they had, I was like, hmm. It was real cute. The bag that they sent me was this bag right here. Teddy Blake offers bags that take all of your favorite luxury brands, designs, and characteristics and put it all into one bag for a very, very affordable price. It's like where affordability meets luxury. And I'll put the technical terms and a real name for this bag all down below the description box. Make sure y'all check that out. Y'all wanna know what's really good, okay? Y'all wanna be technical. The technicalities are gonna be down below, so check it out. I'm gonna give y'all what y'all been asking for and show y'all what I carry in my bags. The first thing I have in my bag is my phone charger. I am terrible at charging my phone. At night, during the day, it can be on 1%. I'm still on YouTube or Instagram full force. Like, thugging it with no fear. I'm gonna spend all these hours on Instagram and you're not gonna go dead. Try me, what, what? I always have it handy. You never know what situations may arise. You may be somewhere off with your friends and your phone may die. And the phone may be really, really needed. If everybody's phone is dead, there's a problem. So even if your phone is not dying, still bring your charger just in case any of your friends may need one. You never really know what'll pop off. My phone is actually on 40% right now. That's crazy. The next thing I have in my bag is my favorite, favorite perfume. This is Escada Aqua de Sol. Whenever I'm feeling fancy, this is the perfume I have to always wear. Going anywhere where I'm wearing some type of heels, this perfume always gets me right. This is actually my second or third bottle. I love anything like citrusy or Melanie sense like that's what this gives me like Melanie beachy just this is that come here boy this is that catch you a man perfume this is that catch somebody's daddy somebody's uncle get this perfume and then you'll be married like in less than 24 hours I promise you just look it up look it up I just keep this handy just to freshen up whenever it is needed most of the time I don't need to freshen up but just in case I always keep it this perfume is pretty much good for like one time use for the day. Favorite perfume, keep it close, just like a pocket rocket, okay? Next thing I have in my bag, I feel like every girl always has this on hand. My lip gloss or my lipsticks, whatever I'm wearing on my mouth that day is always in my bag. These are my Nikki K New York color lip oils. I did do a video featuring the whole collection of these a little while ago. I will leave that link somewhere above in the cards, also down below in the description box if you want to check that out. I have been using these two together combined non-stop since I did that review. I love these. I use these to give me more so of like a natural, just bitten lip look. I mean, I probably done licked everything off my lip right now, but matter of fact, let me put it back on. All right, and boom, we in there. Say if you're going out to eat, you wear a lip gloss, you know you're going to eat all of that off by the end of your meal. It's going to get ate. I'm going to devour it. It's going to get lost with my food. So I keep this so that when I'm done eating, touch myself up, and I'm good to go. Y'all go check these out, they're really, really bomb. These colors are Regina and Shy Chai. The next thing in my bag is, of course, what is that sticky? My little coin purse slash wallet 
slash purse. Whenever I'm in like regular attire, like sweatpants, t-shirt, tie, going to Walmart, going to the bank, running some errands, this is the bag I always take. I'm not really like, like a big bag person, like to take with me all the time. I usually wear bags just for occasions. This is actually a wallet that I've had for like three years straight. Um, it's probably all beat up and weathered now, but I love it. My boyfriend got this for me and I have not put this down or stopped using it ever since. Anything he gives me, I just cherish because <laughs> he's just the sweetest. If you go off somewhere, don't just take your card in your wallet. Always put you some cash in your wallet as well. You never know what machine may shut down. This does not take cards. Your card may not go through. My mama has always preached that to me. Always bring you some tangible cash, okay? The next thing I have, a pencil. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's kind of an odd thing to have in your bag, but most people may bring pens with them wherever they go. I've never really been a big pen person. I don't know. I'm just not really into pens like that. Even in school, I was never that girl. I write super, super sloppy with a pen. It has to be a pencil. So that way I know if I make a mistake, I can erase it. Part of clips we're getting all day, every day, okay? The next thing that is in this bag, child, is my ibuprofen. My pills, my saving grace. If y'all ever catch me without my pills in my purse, it's not gonna be a good day for me or you. A little fun fact, I actually suffer sometimes from having really, really bad migraines. They can last between a day to three days straight if I do not have some ibuprofen on. Day. So I actually had um, one of my migraine spells before I filmed this video, popped two of these bad boys and I was good to go. Your girl is alive and well. <laughs> these are actually the CVS Health Ibuprofen Minis. Um, they are the liquid soft gels. I actually have really, really hard time swallowing pills so I have to always get soft gel pills. If not, I'm gonna be in there gagging and spazzing out like a mug. I have to always have my ibuprofen, my pain relievers, my aspirins, or whatever the case may be on hand, or my head will fly off my body, pretty much, okay? Okay, the next thing I have, a hair scrunchie. A hair scrunchie, hair tie. Y'all know your girl love a 180% wig, a really, really thick wig, a lot of bundles. Um, So with that being said, those little itty bitty scrunchies will never cut it for me. This is actually a very thick and durable scrunchie. They came in a pack, I think, of 20 that I got from Dollar Tree. These are the only hair scrunchies I can use for all of my wigs. Go to your Dollar Tree and get you about three little packets of these. Change your whole life. Promise, change your whole life. And one thing about me, I don't play about my scrunchies. All that buddy, buddy, she, she, all that stuff. Let me borrow a hair scrunchie. No, ma'am. I don't do that. <laughs> no, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. You're gonna have to just hang and look a hot mess for the rest of the night because you're not getting my hair scrunchie. It will take me 10 minutes to find one good, emphasis on one good hair scrunchie. It ain't falling apart. It ain't super duper gaped open and stretched out. My good hair scrunchie, baby, you will not get. Either you make sure your hair is laid before you leave the house or just be prepared to look a hot mess for the rest of the night. <laughs> I'm sorry. The next thing inside of my bag is my tweezers and my eyelash glue. If y'all watch any of my makeup videos before, y'all know that I'm still in that struggling state of putting on my eyelashes. Yes, I've been wearing makeup for a while. Yes, I've been using eyelashes for a while. But no, I still have not mastered that technique. I struggle. Most of the time when you get in your car, you're ready to go somewhere, your rear view mirror shows every imperfection, every flaw, every problem you have in your makeup that day. So when I get in my car, the main things I see a problem with is my lace and my lashes, the two L's that will have you messed up for your whole day. So if I'm in the car, I have my tweezers and my lash glue, I can easily just take the lash off, put it back on, there's no problem. And yeah, that is everything else inside my bag. That is my what's in my bag video. I really, really, really hope you guys enjoyed it as well as enjoyed this bag, honey. Get into it. A big thank you goes out to Teddy Blake for sending me this beautiful bag. If you guys are interested in this bag and Teddy Blake, I'll definitely leave the links to this bag and website down below in the description box. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please do not forget to give your girl a big thumbs up. And first, talk to the Beehive down below. Join the Beehive gang, the Beehive fam, because we are lit and we are never bougie over here. I know you want to keep in contact with your girl because I'm your best friend. You're my best friend. We're all best friends. So add me on Instagram. I mean, what? As always, my lovelies, I love every single one of you. But until next time, your crown may tilt, but you never let it fall. Stay gilded. Purchase your tracks. Oh, now I got to get off the bed. <laughs>